To balance this equation, Na2CO3 plus H2O, let's count the atoms up. We have two sodiums, one carbon, three oxygens, and do not forget this oxygen right here. So we have four oxygens, and then we have two hydrogens. Over on the product side, we have one sodium, one carbon, and then oxygens, we have one here, and again, we have these two here. So that gives us three oxygens, and then just one hydrogen. Why don't we leave the oxygens till last? Let's balance these two sodiums. So I have two on the reactant side and only one on the product. Let's put a coefficient of two. And this two, that applies to the everything here, the NaO and the H. So we have one Na times two. That gives us two of those. And then let's update our oxygen. We have the one oxygen times the two, those two oxygens. Plus we have these two and the CO2. That'll give us four oxygen atoms. And then hydrogens, we have one times two, and that gives us two as well. And we're done. This equation, it is balanced. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Na2CO3, that's sodium carbonate plus H2O water. Thanks for watching.